Hi, Dr. Paul Hader, mass herbalist here. Well, what do you think this is? It's a big package, a bunch of roots. They have a very sweet smell. I have one pulled out here and mm, very sweet, kind of molassesy, kind of flavor. Wonderful stuff. I actually like this flavor a lot. It's very good. And this is Condenopsis or Dang Shin, which is a very popular adaptogen, which has been used for thousands of years in Chinese medicine. And it's uh, also called the poor man's ginseng. You know, ginseng is really expensive. I mean, we got this uh, in Chinatown. And uh, when we were there, when my mom passed away, and this is a whole pound for fourteen fifty. That was great. And ginseng is very expensive, so really great stuff. It uh, it's an adaptogen, gives you more energy and boosts up your immune system, lowers blood pressure, lowers blood pressure, which is um, one of the things that ginseng will increase your blood pressure. So, uh, and it helps with stress in a big way. And it lowers cholesterol, the LDL or bad cholesterol, it lowers down, and triglycerides, it lowers down. So it's really a great thing. I, I use this on a regular basis because I think it's one of the, the herbs that a lot of people should be using. And it really has no side effects. It's used in moderation, and uh, which is a great thing. You know, we don't want side effects. There's no doubt about that. And it also lowers triglycerides and helps to prevent heart attacks and strokes and increases circulation throughout the whole body, which is really great. It also helps with people who have fatigue. If you're one of these older people that has a lot of fatigue and uh, you need to take start taking some Dangshin or Canonopsis, and you can find it on Amazon and eBay and uh, all over the place. And I recommend getting it as a root. You can get it as a powder. You can get it as teas. You can make teas with it, uh, capsules, whatever way you want to do it. It tastes great anyway. So <laughs> what more can he ask for? It's really wonderful. It's called uh, Woodland Bonnet, Bellflower, uh, Condenopsis, Bastard Ginseng, False Ginseng, uh, all kinds of things, Dangshin in, in uh, Chinese medicine. And it boosts up your immune system, and it's great for fighting off HIV. It slows the aging process. It also increases blood flow to the hands and feet. If you're one of these people who has cold hands and cold feet all the time, you might want to do that. Anyway, guys, here we are sweltering in humidity, and he's wearing a sweater. <laughs> <laughs> Always cold. Dang, shouldn't it would be good for him. <laughs> also, if you want more energy, key energy or chi energy in your body, then Dang Shin is greatly great for you. And it also opens up the uh, coronary arteries so you end up with more energy, uh, blood flowing through there and you have more energy. It also helps with the symptoms of... Uh, Radiation therapy, if you're going through radiation therapy, and well, it's nasty, there's no doubt about it. Uh, Dangshin or condenopsis can help in a great way. It also, it also um, helps with uterine bleeding, and, or if you have, you know, lots of um, blood coming when you have your periods, this will help also. Also, it's a remedy for arthritis and joint and problems and muscle conditions because it's an anti-inflammatory. So if you have redness and swelling and pain, this is great for you. <laughs> I highly recommend it. So it'll be really good. The dose is from 15 grams a day up to about 30. I've even seen people take 60, but if you take more than 60 a day, it's not good. Uh, the mod, I recommend 15 to 30 grams at, at the maximum. And I don't take very much of it. I just take a little bit of it. And I think it's really great for keeping you young. There's no doubt about it. Uh, it also contains some essential oils and lots of saponins, which are antioxidants. 
uh, some resins and glucosides and alkaloids and lots of amino acids and inulin, which is good for boosting up your probiotics in your body and on and on and on. There are lots more antioxidants also. So it's really good with that. Uh, powerful agent. I, I would recommend it to anybody, really. Uh, I think it's one of the best herbs on the planet, right, right up there with uh, chlorella. I, uh, I don't take anything on a regular basis other than chlorella and a few other food-based things, but this is one that you can take quite often. And it also helps with vomiting and diarrhea. I knew a lady that had problems with her liver and she couldn't take peppermint so it really bothered her and so Dang Shin or Canonopsis was really good for the, the also for vomiting and diarrhea. Also it's uh, opens up the heart and it helps to give the heart more energy and the powerful antioxidants helps to get rid of free radicals because <clears throat> of all those antioxidants and, uh, and you know that helps to keep away disease and you know well that's that's super important also it's uh boosts up our ability of the vitamin e in our body to help with our heart which is really you know, good and helps with phlebitis if you have phlebitis and you have pain in your legs or that's boy that's not an easy thing so dang Shen can help with that also uh, it can get help get rid of the, some of the plaques and the arteries in your heart. It also uh, relaxes and increases the size, the dilator of the arteries and the uh, coronaries and helps to strengthen the muscles of the heart. And uh, that's why I call it a key energy inducer. It brings also energy into the lungs in Chinese medicine and to the spleen. So we have this constant supply of energy um, this helps with irregular heartbeats also. It also helps with thyroid function and really great for the liver. If you have hepatitis or fibrosis or cirrhosis of the liver, this can also help with that. It also helps with stimulating the immune system. This is boost up your T cell production, which is really good, man. I know you can kill off all those bacteria that are invading and viruses too. So that's really important. And uh, and keep viral diseases down and also helps with cancer uh, because it boosts up our immune system so our body can fight off cancers. You know, our body on the average kills about 100 cancer starts every single day. So we need to have a strong immune system to go after those cancer starts, especially now. Well, we have so many heavy metals in everything. Everything we're eating has heavy metals in it. So it, it really is important. Also, it's important that uh, it helps the lungs and uh, with bronchitis and asthma and helps the, the uh, openings of the bronchi to open up and relax so we have more passage of air, which is really great. Studies also show that it helps with gastric ulcers and uh, that's important and it helps to heal gastric ulcers and prevent gastric ulcers so and it helps with kidney disease and glaucoma fibroids prostate disease and pancreatitis also i mean this is a, an all-inclusive herb which it does a great job like i said it's an anti-inflammatory helps with diabetes and with the uh other things that happen as a complication to diabetes probably the most important thing uh, and also we, a lot of studies showing uh, in connection with using it with ginkgo biloba, it also helps with memory and learning capacity. And uh, that was in the Alternative Therapies and Health Medicine Journal. It showed that. Also helps with uh, shortness of breath. And if you're a person that just can't breathe, it helps with that. Fatty liver disease. This is a great... Um, herb that helps with fatty liver disease. So if you have fatty liver disease from uh, just from what you eat or eating, I see a plethora of a lot of people with fatty liver disease right now. Uh, it has to do with diet. There's no doubt about it. And some people with drinking, but it has to do with diet. And uh, if you have muscle wasting, you know, maybe you're older, you're not moving very much, this will help with that also. 
coughing, wheezing, you know, if you have a lot of coughing, wheezing, that this will help also. Um, you can find it at Asian markets. Uh, I found this in the, uh, an herbal, Chinese herbal store in Chinatown in, in San Francisco. But you can find it also online, like I said, on Amazon and eBay. And it's very inexpensive, so everybody can afford it. A pound like that will last you, uh, you know, three or four years. And if you keep it in a cool, right place, uh, in a closed glass jar, it will keep a very, very long time. There's no doubt about it. And sometimes I keep them in the fridge, and that will keep them for a very, very long time. Uh, in moderate use, there's really no side effects. They've only had one person who took a bunch of it, mainly like over 60 grams a day, uh, ever in the history of using it that had a problem. So it's very, very safe. And like I said, it's been used for thousands upon thousands of years. And so uh, I highly recommend Condonopsis or Dang Shin. And I think it's really important that we uh, not give up on life. I know I was visiting with a friend and a friend, it was kind of like he's in the 70s and he was like, well, kind of like my time to die type of thing. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't believe that way. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. We all have a gift to give, and there's always a way that we can help somebody else. And it's really important that we keep motivated and moving and try to uh, make a difference in somebody else's life, no matter what that is. Uh, some of us have different gifts. There's no doubt. Maybe we can sing in a great way. Maybe we were a wonderful yoga instructor. I just saw a lady who was 99 who was a wonderful yoga instructor. <laughs> and she broke her hip, but she still does yoga. She said, I'm not as good on that leg as I used to be. But she said, it's not slowing me down. I'm going to make that 100. And so uh, there you go. That's the attitude that we need to have in order to move forward and change your life. And... Attitude is everything. There's no doubt about it. Uh, I see a lot of people who are not willing to change. And change is going to come if you like it or not. <laughs> you might as well go with the flow because it's going to happen. And laugh a lot. You know what I mean? I laugh all the time. And you got to go with the flow. Otherwise, you're resisting. You know, it's kind of like a big rock in the middle of a stream. Uh, and the water's moving against it. <clears throat> yeah. Eventually, over thousands of years, that water will wear down that rock. And uh, so if we are a leaf, though, and we flow down with it, with the water, you know, there's no resistance. We just keep moving, and we end up with that great, in that great ocean and part of the oneness. And uh, we allow ourselves to understand that it's uh, our duty to help those people who are suffering. And when we do that, everything is great. Uh, so never give up hope. And never allow yourself to uh, just say, you know, my life is over. I can't help anybody or I'm just so tired. If you're tired, you need to have some changes happen. And there's something wrong with maybe physically or spiritually. And or maybe there's a mental change, something, one little thought that needs to be changed in order so that heart, that love of life to be ignited again. And when we do that, everything changes. And we feel exuberated about living life every single day. You know, I give a, get up at 5 o'clock every morning, and I can't wait to get out of bed. Uh, there's no doubt about it. You know, I... I I look forward to the interactions with people and helping people. And uh, that brings me to, if you care to subscribe, that's great. I appreciate that greatly and tell other people. I do all my consultations for free. All my contact information is down below and would love to help you in any way, shape or form, spiritually or herbally. And uh, if you care to make a donation, that is greatly appreciated, really. Uh, we had a lot of bills with going to see my mother when she passed away. So anyway, have a great day, and, and uh, if you want to get a hold of me, feel free. I'm always here. Have a wonderful day, and remember, most of all, I love you.